Hello and welcome to web learning with knowledge you shared. So quickly I soldered some connectors to see how it's working. I connected also some batteries. I won't show you the whole video because um, the battery started to get hot and um, always it's smart to start testing a board before you even do anything and uh, what I found out for some reason the batteries are shorted out. So that's why it's so important to say not tested. You see, uh, this doesn't matter because it goes somewhere else. I'll look uh, through the design and try to see uh, where is my mistake on this. And I'll fix it and I'll order new ones because it's again $2 plus shipping, so it's nothing. And uh, I'll test them back again. So stay tuned. Thank you. So I've opened the Easy EDA and I'll try to see what's going on in this. First I'll click the photo viewer so I can see this is the correct design. Now those pins, let me turn off the grounding area, ground area. So this is net. 14V. This is net B6, and this is B6, and this is B5, and this is B5. So, what's going on? Why is this not giving me the right? What happens if I move the ground plane? It's over masking it. So the ground plane was over masking it and it didn't automatically do this. So this is the top side. So I can see the bottom layer. Let's see the design of the part. So this part uses So this part doesn't uh, has on the top layer and the bottom layer the area that needs to be done for soldering. I need to add those. Okay, so now it's okay. There's a gap between the ground and the pad itself. The even though the DRC is telling me that there is something wrong with the net, um, I looked everywhere and even looking at the picture, 
everything looks correct and if I look at the bottom side everything is connected so I don't know why it's giving me this error message at least from what I can see everything is uh, just fine so I'll go ahead and manufacture this board and uh, I'll let you know when I get it and after I'll test it thank you